Hey, Oak Pro. This is the core. Uh, got another review for you. Time we got some Baja Apple, courtesy of the Mad Wolf. Good looking out. It's in my nice little baggie. And uh, inside we find. I can get it to the top without making a mess. There we go. We can find a nice little shirt. This stuff is like kind of like Nakla, but more strip threaded, uh, shredded, threaded, shredded, like a hookah hookah. Comes in like scrawny little pieces. Um, it's a really even consistency. It's not like all kind of crazy. It's like um, great care was taken into the cutting out process. It's very uniform. The uh, smell on this well, it don't smell like an apple. And it don't smell like an apple candy. It don't smell sweet. It don't smell anything. And I wasn't even really sure about this, so phone call. Hey, me some lowdown on this stuff, cause I don't know. And uh, this Saudi guys, he told me that it's more uh, the Baja Apple is more traditional than anything else. It's like old style. So, I don't know much about that, but it don't smell like candy and stuff. He said, I really like it. And I said, well, I will tell you later. So, it kind of smells apple -y, but it kind of doesn't smell apple -y. I'm not really sure. Uh, we're, we're working with Tron. Crazy little, let's see, we got ghetto wind cover, little, little teeny vase. Cobra hose. Got like, ow, the wind cover is hot. Two silver tabs up there, about half done. Still been going like 20 minutes. And uh, smoke and flavor on this stuff. The smoke is really nice. The flavor is not sweet. Hmm? It's not bad. By no means. But I wasn't really sure what to expect and I was scared that there was going to be some top secret. Ooh! That they always sneak in there with apples, but it's not here. Some pretty dense clouds for the low amount of heat I got going up there. Um. <clears throat> I'm gonna say that the flavor is more traditional than most. It is um, like old worldish. It's not like this Candyland crap. Um, I was hoping for a little more apple taste. It's not really here, but that's not really a bad thing for me. It's all right. The fact that the Baja only comes in 250 grams probably means this flavor I wouldn't buy because it will take me a while to get to it because this is something I need to be like ready and in the mood for. And I'm probably not that way enough to warrant that much. But I'm going to say it's not terrible. It's pretty good actually, but it's not quite up my alley. I a little more apple in it. So, 
this is the cord for Hookah Pro. This, uh, some Baja Apple. It's good, not fabulous, and I'm gonna skip it on the buy list. So that's my rating. Not buy. Maybe you will, maybe you won't. But I'm saying this guy, not gonna buy. See you in reviews later.